Hello, I'm Mrs Barnard and I teach film studies. Why should you study film at A-level? Because it's a brilliant course and you will really have your um, eyes opened to a whole new world of film that perhaps you haven't been exposed to before. Um, we offer a huge range of different topic areas and you'll be watching films from all over the world and from different periods in, um, in Hollywood history. Our components are split into three. So the first things that we would look at um, uh, in component one is uh, Hollywood and we look at it from very much from an institutional point of view. So you look at films like um, Some Like It Hot which is from 1959, a kind of classic um, screwball comedy um, and Apocalypse Now from the 1970s which uh, are vastly, vastly different films but they represent classic Hollywood and new Hollywood. We then move on to British cinema and in this uh, component, we look at train spotting and uh, films like Under the Skin, which are both fairly um, narrative based films, and that's the uh, area that we look at narrative and ideology. Uh, we then look at American cinema. American cinema, uh, we do Captain Fantastic and Selma, which is about the civil rights movement. In that particular section, we, our focus is on audience, so we're looking at how audiences respond to film. In component two, it takes our um, film experience a little bit further and we look at global cinema. So we look at some brilliant films, one by Guillermo del Toro, my favorite director, um, Pan's Labyrinth, um, which you may have seen before. It's a fairly commercial film. And City of God, which is a Brazilian film. It's a gangster-based film. And we look at those in, uh, in, in terms of micro elements, which is things like cinematography, editing, sound, etc. Then we move on to some of our specialist areas, and these are the sort of smaller elements of the courses. These are only 20 markers as opposed to the rest that are all 40. Um, but we then look at things like experimental film, uh, which is looking at um, how art-based experimental cinema um, is produced, what sort of what, what marks it as different from other mainstream films. We also look at silent cinema. So we study a film called Sunrise from, the, from 1927. It's on YouTube, you could check it out in advance. And that is looking at primarily uh, German expressionism and the difference between that and realist cinema. We also look at documentary and we do uh, the documentary Amy, which is a film by uh, Asif Kapadia and it's about Amy Winehouse and her life. And we look at filmmakers' theories and digital technology within the documentary genre. We have very specialised teachers in film studies. I've taught film studies for many, many years. I'm an Educas uh, film examiner, and I also write uh, articles for Media Magazine. Mr. Dixon, who is my um, fellow teacher, uh, he teaches um, film studies and looks at um, writing lots of articles for Media Magazine and uh, for various publications like The Guardian as much as possible. He's also published two books on film and media. So we're very, we're very, um, well-rounded team and very knowledgeable about the subject. In terms of component three, which is our last component, um, that is the coursework element of the course, and that's worth 30% of the course overall, uh, whereas the other two are 35% each. The, course, uh, the coursework comprises of you looking at a lot of short films, getting some ideas from those short films, creating a script, putting a storyboard together, and then writing an evaluation of the whole process. It's a lovely way of kind of dipping your toes in and getting some experience of being creative and using all of that knowledge that you've, you've taken from the course and putting that into practice. In terms of assessment, we always get very good results in film studies. Last year, we had 15% A stars, 25% uh, A's, 25% B's, 35% C's. So we, d we did really, really well. Uh, I'd love to see you in September. Um, please think about uh, learning film studies. It's a great subject and I'm sure you'd really enjoy it.